Hey, it's Mr. Leonidas here. I hope you're doing well. This is going to be a video about a new piece of gear that I picked up from the Camelback website. It is the fresh filter. I've attached it to the Antidote Reservoir. I'm going to show all that up close in detail just here in a moment. But I first want to mention that a subscriber of mine, he made a comment on my Camelback Ambush video and told me about a filtration system that actually goes directly into your reservoir um, that you can attach it to it. And I thought that was pretty awesome, so I went to the uh, Camelback website, checked it out, and uh, it's called the Fresh Filter, and it was, it was about 20 bucks. And uh, so I ordered that up, and then I got a new uh, reservoir, the Antidote, and that one was about like 35. And because uh, I, I, I definitely needed a new uh, uh, reservoir, I've been using a couple different ones for a couple years now, so it's nice to have an upgrade. And uh, so far, so good. I'm really loving it. It's a pretty neat, easy setup, and I've got you know got the hose right here. I have Atax FG hose cover on here and um, the new hose is pretty neat definitely uh, definitely digging it pretty easy to use uh, long enough right where I need it but uh, like I said I'm gonna kinda get up, get up close and personal and show you how that it's called the quick link system I'll show you how that works and show you what I got going on in my pack so here we go right, so I made it back from my day hike and I thought I would go over the uh, reservoir and the filtration system that I have uh, inside of my Camelback Ambush here and this is just an awesome day pack that uh, it's just a military and tactical style Camelback uh, and just uh, really works for me so I've got it adapted well to, to what I do so uh, without further ado I'll just go ahead and st um, get, get into the meat of the matter and uh, here is uh, the reservoir, the antidote reservoir water bladder go ahead and pull that out and I had a pretty good uh, good long tube for it and I have that covered in an ATAX FG tube cover and um, this model, the antidote model, has kind of a switch to the side instead of the traditional on and off switch, the up and down of the Camelback tubes which is uh, took me just a little bit uh, to get used to it but uh, really it works really well, definitely digging it but uh, here is uh, the antidote and uh, it, this is the 2 liter model, the 70 ounce model. There's a couple different variations, uh, like there's a smaller version, a larger version. This is kind of the mid-sized one. It uh, works well for me. I was actually used to having a 3 uh, liter um, water reservoir in this one, but I moved it over to my uh, Max Edition uh, Condor 2 pack to have a larger reservoir. But uh, it's definitely definitely working well for me. And so some of the upgrades they did was on it, instead of uh, having a threads all the way around that have it just like a quarter turn um, a quarter lock system so it just kind of locks in like that you don't have to spin it all continuously all the way around it's kind of a pain um, when you fill it up with water and you're trying to get it set this one's simple easy to use uh, definitely digging it and then uh, it, it basically has what we call the quick link system which is the, probably the most vast improvement I've seen on any of these water bladders and uh, it works like uh, just you know with the hit of the buttons here I can take out this is the fresh filter system and it just links in there like that and what's awesome about this water bladder this reservoir is that nothing leaks out it's pretty much a self-contained unit with uh, the releases here and it has like basically like a valve in there and then you have your o-rings on the attachments so everything's pretty much very well self-contained um, you're not going to really get any, any harmful elements in there they did a good job on it and um, so I'll go ahead and show this is the filtration system I was talking about and you just kind of unscrew the top here this is like a small little carbon filter in there and uh, you can get the, the replacements off uh, Camelback or their website or um, some other dealers and a pretty awesome little setup uh, price wise this cost me about 20 bucks and the reservoir is about $30 range the replacement filters the fresh filters aren't, aren't all that expensive it's about $10 for two of the filters and they cover uh, 120 liters of water each so that's that's pretty awesome so for a two liter water bladder like this you're looking at 60 plus uh, full reservoirs at that I mean that's that's excellent and for for the price there so a pretty awesome little system uh, the first thing I want to mention is uh, very very lightweight even even with the little filter in there and the filtration system very very lightweight definitely definitely digging that so far lightweight uh, compact um, didn't really notice it was in my pack hardly uh, so like I said lightweight compact and um, easy to use the ease of uh, ease of use is really high on this and um, they do have a quick link um, sort of adapters that you can use for older uh, reservoirs but uh, 
I just decided to go ahead and upgrade, and I think was an excellent idea. I've really, I had a man, I had a really good time with this. Like I said, the ease of use on the whole, you know, the reservoir, including the filter, is a uh, man is is great for this. But uh, that's that's pretty much the overview on uh, this filtration system and the the antidote water bladder. As for uh, you know what you know how this will help me in some of my excursions is like if I. Uh, I can maybe even stay out longer um, and, and get more water because uh, if I have uh, since I have this titanium pot in there, I can boil some water and then let it cool down and then put it directly into my uh, into the reservoir and then uh, let it flow through the filter. Then I've got clean water. I can stay out longer, um, you know, longer distances at that, even though I don't necessarily have um, a very you know large. Uh, uh, reservoir, which is awesome. So, you know, the survival attributes of something like this are very high. You know, if you really thought you'd be out for a long, long time, you know, throw another fresh filter in the pack. Um, I don't think I'm going to be doing that. I don't think I'm going to have to fill it up, you know, 60 times <laughs> somewhere. But, I mean, you never know. It might be, you know, handy to kind of carry one along. There's the overview of the filter and, you know, some information about the new uh, reservoirs here. And then, you know, I definitely it works for me. I think this, you know, the level of survivability for something like this, you know, de it definitely uh, it definitely helps you. And like I said, the weight is not a big factor in something like this. But um, definitely digging it. I definitely are going to recommend this to people who are very serious about, you know, um, especially uh, being in the out outdoors, biking, or uh, especially um, hiking uh, and backpacking because this is something that is going to help you. And um, definitely, definitely not going to hinder you, and uh, definitely worth trying out um, because even even the money, it's not all that expensive. But anyway, that's pretty much all I've got on that. So, it's Mr. Leonidas signing out, and I appreciate your time.